interested in a meaty, spicy and rich chili paste, I'm sure this video will catch your attention. Hi everyone, or as we say in Farsi, Salam be Hamegi. This is Rosina from rosinaspersiankitchen.com. Welcome to my channel, where you can cook delicious food recipes. As a food blogger, I'm in touch with many wonderful food bloggers around the world. And one of them is Charlie. Charlie is a great food blogger in the States. We decided to share our recipes together and have a kind of collaboration. Clearly, he has cooked one of my Persian food recipes and presented in his own YouTube channel. And today, I'm going to share with you one of his recipes. It's called Cincinnati Chili Paste. By the way, Charlie not only has a channel in YouTube, but also he has a beautiful uh, food web page at WordPress. I will leave links for his YouTube channel and also uh, his web page at WordPress in description box. You can visit his channel and enjoy his wonderful food recipes. Ingredients for making Cincinnati chili paste are 14 gram chocolate, unsweetened, one tablespoon cinnamon powder, one teaspoon garlic powder, one teaspoon cumin, one quarter of teaspoon all spices, one tablespoon oregano, one quarter of teaspoon ground cloves, one quarter of teaspoon red pepper flakes, salt and black pepper to taste, half a teaspoon sugar, two tablespoon apple cider vinegar, one large onion finely chopped, some olive oil, two cups of boiled water, 500 gram ground turkey or beef, three tablespoon tomato paste, half a cup of cooked dark kidney beans. In a large pan, heat the oil. Add onions and saute chopped onions over medium high heat and cook onions until softened. It will take about five, six minutes. After five, six minutes, onions softened and we can add ground beef or turkey. Break up the meat into small pieces and cook the meat until brown. Meat still is cooking and I try break up it into small pieces as much as possible. Now I mix tomato paste with two cups of boiled water to make something like tomato soup. Now add tomato soup and cooked beans to the meat and give it good stir to combine. Add vinegar and finally all your spices. Give a good stir. And simmer for about 30 minutes until cooked and thickened. Oh my God, my Cincinnati chili paste is cooking and I'm looking forward to try it. Looks fantastic. Here we go. My Cincinnati chili paste is ready. Looks amazing. You can serve this delicious 
Cincinnati chili paste over spaghetti or you can make a small pieces As I said earlier, not only you can serve this beautiful Cincinnati chili paste over a spaghetti, but also over hot dog, or you can serve it with your favorite accompaniments, like this, or this. Looks lovely. It's really delicious. Honestly, guys, it's really good recipe. I mean, combination of beautiful, warm spices like cumin, cloves, cinnamon, or chocolate, garlic powder, oregano. It creates beautiful, hearty, delicious, and comfy meal. Thank you very much, Charlie. Or as we say in Farsi, خیلی ممنون, Charlie. So, that's it for this video. Please pick up your free ebook that I have put just for you with five easy, quick, and delicious recipe to help you with cooking. I will leave a link in description box and you can use it. If you have enjoyed this video, don't forget to like it. And if you are getting value, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel and join my YouTube family. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so you won't miss any new videos. Take care and lots of love. Bye!